um, so I am his director of women's affairs, which means I am involved in policy and constituent affairs for the women's organizations and women across the state. About a year ago, I joined the governor's staff, and um, he said, go out and find out what's going on. So I did that. And as a result of that, we ended up with a women's agenda, a 30-point women's agenda. And we've been working really hard, and the legislature's been working really hard to get some of those things passed. In 2015, uh, the governor had a women's equality agenda, and there were a number of issues on that agenda, including those around sex trafficking. And those passed uh, both houses, and we signed them in 2015. And I know Senator Robach and Assemblyman Morelli are part of that work to get those things done. So this is one issue that we all come together on. No one disagrees. We just really need really good ideas about how to fix it. So we're out here, I'm out here, they're out here, talking to you about how do we do it. Um, a few weeks ago I was in Seneca Falls and I was speaking at a Notre Dame event. And they had a professor there who said, who talked about women's issues. And she looked at me and she said, you know, you're really doing the work. But tonight, I look around and you all are really doing the work. So one of the things that I think is important as we, as we talk tonight and, and have conversations is really understand that this is about erasing the stigma around violence against women. That we need to find a place where women can be safe to talk about what's happening to them and that they can be supported and believed. So this is really what this event is about for me and why I'm here. And I want to thank all of you for the work that you do every day. Thank you.